Hi guys and welcome back. We're here with another episode of our Wrath of Sparta campaign with myself and Scrim. Hello. And we are straight into action where we left off in the last episode. We have a another battle um, and a defense for me against this time against Macedon. It looks like I'm getting massively pushed back on lots of different fronts at the moment. Ah, uh, it's not looking too good, but luckily for you, I've got armies that are ready to push up north now, so hopefully we can start taking some land back. Hopefully, yes. So we will go into this battle, and we will fight on the battlefield. I am not sallying out, though, because that's just never going to be a good idea, being out in the Yeah, so what, what have we got? Yeah, it's looking pretty, uh... Hmm... Not looking too good for you. No, this campaigning army as well has been on um, a lot of... Uh, been on the advance, and it's got caught out. So, yeah. Anyway. Let's see what happens. Yeah, we will. Battle of Pharsalus. I really hope I'm not fighting out in the open. Because it says bat battle, but... No, no, we're in the village. Oh, good. Ah, yes, we are. It's just, you've got a lot of uh, javelin men and stuff, so... Yeah, I'm going to have to really hope that my um, missiles can win the day. But you have one, two, three, four, five, six as well. <laughs> Mm. So, I only outnumber you by one. Well. Yeah, those light hot potatoes are pretty good. Oh, it looks different. Does it's it? not the usual generic village. Ah, I'm still loading in. Poor. Is this a level three village? Maybe. I have not a clue. Fastless is quite a famous city. I think that might be why then, because it's it not the be. generic rubbish, which is I'm, which is good. Yeah, I'm pretty sure fast. There's something happens at Fastless, and either the like in the Peloponnesian War or in a war with the Romans or something like that. I can't remember. No, Philippi. That's Philippi I'm thinking of. Maybe, Howdy. I don't know. Maybe they just fancied giving Farsus a good one. If anyone does well, know anything. Have. Yeah, if anyone does know anything about Farsus, please let me know because interesting. It reminds me in Shogun too when I gave that another crack. All these castles were pretty much the same, but it was this one that was surrounded by a moat. And I was like, ah, oh, this is new. Obviously yeah. I won because I had artillery, like to the to the brinks. Nice. Artillery in that game is just the game changer. It really is, isn't it? It's uh, pretty, pretty nasty. I've not really it played... It is nasty. I've not played much Shogun 2. I need to... Uh, I think it's on this... I think I've got it on this computer. I might not. <laughs> Sh Shogun 2, I, when I first bought it, I never liked it. Didn't play it for best part of three years. And then I finally played it. I thought it was all right. Bought for the Samurai. Yeah. And I loved it ever since. And I was like, why did I not play this when it first came out? Why did I not get this DLC when it first came out? It's um, a very fast-paced game, isn't it? It's the most popular one, I think, as well. Yeah, it certainly is up there with Medieval 2. I'm pretty sure, I think Medieval 2 might still hold that title of most popular, but then again, I haven't, I haven't really kept an eye on it. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I was a bit slow going in. This po The old computer's like... <gasps> Rome too. Just Thinking been, about it. Yeah, I've just been playing so much Imperator. It's now gone to this, and it's like I've actually got to load in a whole army. <laughs> anyway, oh, it does look. It looks very spacious. It does, isn't it? It's nice. I also my city's already still on fire. Yeah, yeah it, it was perfect, and then when you loaded in, it went poof. poof. And there's two two little fires going on there. Lovely. <laughs> oh right, what am I going to do? What am I doing? There's your centre point, which is highly undefendable. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Okay. Do. Is your all your army there? Well, it is for now, yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm just. Oh yeah, yeah you I'm, can see me, can't yeah, you? Yeah, I'm just looking to see what you've um, got to see what I can plan. I, I I should have really looked when we were chat, <laughs> chatting and had everything up, but hey. Yeah, okay. I'm probably going to let you do your setting up first. And then, I'm already way ahead here. I know, just... yeah. I'm just kind of... Because I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with uh, my old army. <laughs> can you see my forces? No, I can't see anything. Perfect. Well, no, until I reposition my soldiers, I can't see anything anyway. Mm -hmm. um, let's put you guys here. Have a little bit of support. 
Let's have these guys here. Where can you come in over there then? Oh, very much, very openly. Hmm. Okay. Still never get used to light hoplites. You won't. What about them? They're, they're pretty good. Yeah, I know, but I just. I, I'm very much the heavy armor type of guy. That's fair enough. <laughs> okay. I'm okay, getting... I think I'm good to go. You're good to go. Okay, I'm getting there. I've got a plan. A man with a plan. It is. Um. Okay, so you can't. Oh, that's annoying. Spear infantry at your command. Missile infantry ready. I can't really even give myself reserves in this goddamn battle. <laughs> Which is annoying. Every man for themselves, yeah. Almost, yeah. This is not even a full stack army, which isn't helping the garrison's a bit shocking. Ready for orders. Yeah, it's like six units per thing, isn't it? Something like that, yeah. You've been spying on my army. Well, I saw some bits and pieces. Yeah, that's fair enough. I can't blame a man for his espionage. <laughs> I'm very tactful when I do these things. Mm. Superior intelligence. That or I looked at a tab. <laughs> Um, and then you go somewhere like there. Do -ba -do -ba -do. Yeah, sorry, I'm nearly done. Nearly, yeah, it's all right. Nearly got this sorted. <laughs> Are you gonna rush me instead? <laughs> put you under pressure now. Da 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 da. Okay, if you can put me under pressure. Oh, you like? I am very much nearly done. What are you then? What's over here then? Oh, we didn't put you. I need it there now. Okay, I thought I had a spare one, but I didn't. Shame, right. Oh, we started. Yes, we have. I'm going to see I'm what you're going to do. Oh, I'm going to run away and surrender. No, I'm joking. This is what I'm worried about. That, that unit in particular. <laughs> If we can deal with that, then uh, the game's good. Oh, I should actually also tell all my missiles to be on, like running away <laughs> if they have running to. away mode. Yeah, yeah, if they have to. I, I always forget that. It's my first mistake. And what have you got then? A lot light hot plates. At least are gonna be prone to missiles. Yeah, they're gonna be pretty easy to kill off. Uh, well, yeah, but there's a lot of them. That's the problem. I'm just seeing like the frontal assault is six units of them. Gosh. <laughs> militia militia hotplates, yeah. They're okay. They got bigger shields, I think, compared to Uh they militia have better melee defense. Uh yeah, that that's kind of it, actually. More morale. Mm-hmm. What are yep. you? Maybe? Yeah, that's that's it. <laughs> <laughs> Might ask you to move there actually. Yeah, I'm not really sure how I'm going to hold this. Basically, I, as you people can see on mine, I'm going for there, there, and there to try and stop him coming in here, here, and in here. This is the only... Mm. This here is the only, the only worry. And unless he comes all the way around here. I miss the settlements where you could get only like a couple of choke points and you could just hold there like the Attila ones. Yeah, this is this is massively sprawled out. I mean, oh, is that is that seriously your, or is that your western? No, that's your eastern. What's Have my put, eastern? This is your northern. So I just saw a glimpse of your northern defenses of your six six hoplites per thing. Uh, yeah, they're like it's perfectly <laughs> filling in that nice gap. But hey, I feel so sorry for them. Yeah, it's not look it's not gonna be beautiful at all. I'll let them know that. Actually I'll have you over here as well. Cause this is gonna be more of a problem. It's am 
what have you got here? Mercenary creature and archers. Well, I'll we'll have to do something about them. Nah, you're right. As I said, they're really good as well. The Macedonian army clearly can afford a lot. But if this army does get destroyed and another one's already been destroyed, I've then got a lot of money to rebuild stuff. Yeah. Like I say, I've got my armies in position now as well to do some stuff, so... I hope so. Hopefully we can see that in this episode. I'd like to see you finally not... Finally moving away from this one place that's just constantly... Rebelling. So you've got... What have you got here? Mercenary Agree and Axe... Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, and he's now just going to shoot me a bit. Oh, shit. That was the wrong button. Hmm. There we go. Go in there, and then... You come over here and tell us... Yeah, the general's under attack, because he's having to support, you idiot. <laughs> right, excellent. We're doing okay. He says, well, really, really not look. Uh, men are already fleeing, those six men. Those six men are fleeing. Poor them. What are these? These are slingers. You can't reach over here. Slingers. Slingers, I still think, are the best pound for pound infantry. Oh, who's breaking? Oh, okay. Javelins are getting absolutely rinsed. Uh, by my. by your. Um, your units there. Okay. Yeah, the militia and the hot plots aren't doing amazingly well, I've noticed. Well, I can't really. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, but then they're up against hot plots, which are pretty leveled up, which is really annoying because if this army does, like, break and disintegrate, then. I have to bring up my second second squad. Yeah, also Deal like with that. Oh, oh, you having to bring up more units? God, I have to bring up some more resilient units. Let's say because your units of six hoplites seem to be actually holding against an entire. Uh... Yeah, they're good at that. <laughs> yeah, apparently. Which is bizarre, considering there's only six men there. I really also want to beat your goddamn um, creature and archers, because they're really annoying. Really annoying. But hey. Alright, there we go. I can't really tell if I'm winning any of these fights. It's a bit of a stalemate currently, not gonna lie. Just put everything that I can in hoplite formation. Yeah. I wonder if these guys are actually throwing the javelins. Yeah, they're, they're firing slowly. Oh, an entire unit has perished. Well, that's good of them. Uh, I have realised that I am breaking a lot of units. Oh, finally those Cretan archers are going to break. <laughs> They're starting to break, but they haven't broken. There they go. They're gone. Oh, nah. Uh, That's because I've moved them. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it. <laughs> Not today. You coward. Mm. <laughs> Stand and fight like real men. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm looking at the shields for the light hoplites. They look a similar size to the militia hoplite ones. I like how this is what I'm discussing in the end, it's just... <laughs> yeah, who's got a bigger shield? I have a bigger shield. I have bigger shields than you all. Um, take I'm out. just zooming in here to get some interesting shots. It's looking, uh, a lot of my dead are littering the floor, which is why I prefer hoplites, because they are just superior. Yeah. But uh, I fear my militia hoplites are now going to be the next ones to break as well. I can see some breaking. Oh! Interesting move. 
Okay. I try to get him. <laughs> <laughs> not yeah, quick, I s not quick. Oh, smart. At your Fire! Very smart. I'm breaking through slightly. Yeah. Yeah, that's gonna basically end them. But I'm gonna shoot you in the back while I while while you do it. <laughs> yeah, that that might be that might be it. To be honest, uh, what, on your side. Well, yeah, that that little uh, move that you did there is kind of a bit painful. We should run the middle. Yeah, it's a good move. It, it is, but is it working? Because I think they've just realigned themselves again. Uh, and there's a few that have. Oh no, all the ones that are. Um, like. That were behind have all been massacred by my men and slingers. But the, it's a very thin line, and you're now breaking my hot plates, which is worrying. Oh, you're just shooting my hot plates. That's so kind of you. Hmm. Oh, my help! My cavalry just gonna charge in here and get massacred oh every single one of them died brave men yeah and there we go that whole flank's gone yeah there's not much i can do now not much that can be done now it's all just mopping up a little bit it is i don't know how many i've killed but not enough is the answer yeah i've got a lot of green units still kicking about oh yeah here we go i'm yeah. i'm kind of carving in a little bit yeah here. the hot plates held for ages they're down to like seven and it's still breaking it's oh it's just so it's and so here comes the cavalry <laughs> just charge it and kill them with all my missiles <laughs> swarming yeah the axemen have proven somewhat resilient they to actually, cavalry. they're very good against cavalry i found they're very um useful to have as melee units. Oh my god, all these units that were broken. I'm debating, I might get the Axemen as my missiles if I can, if they're not too expensive either. Uh, some... they do, yeah, they do act as, um, I think the Javelin men as well. Yeah. Which, yeah that's the one is... I want to look at. Oh, the shame isn't telling. I mean, my unit, some of my units are getting some insane amount of kills. I also hope that this isn't like my... I don't think it's my faction leader, so... Oh yeah, my faction leader's very safe. He's, like, somewhere else. <laughs> I'll be sending mine into combat soon. Very good. be marching alongside you? Well, nowhere near me. I was gonna... <laughs> <laughs> my, my armies are very dead in that part of the world. I need to rebuild. I need to be careful, though, because I'm getting plus one public order per turn with three armies, but one army isn't fully built. Oh. So I need to play my cards right and what I do next. So I may have to sit tight for a little bit. Oh longer. no! Don't say that. We need to. We need to push out and kill some more of these armies. We're like only for maybe a couple of turns while my second army gets at least a couple of units in. But yeah, I'll be ready to go. This is total oh. war, Scrim. We must push. I've been at war with the rebels for ages. I'm literally at war with every single faction in this uh, oh. in this Close game. <laughs> I know, and I keep losing my settlements to rebels. Yeah, I've killed. O I killed over half of them. Well, around half. Of just them. about around half. Yeah, you did. Yeah, not too bad. Your hop. See, that's why hoplites are just superior units. Yeah, but I mean, I've got a lot of uh, income probably now at my disposal to re rebuild. But... Uh, yeah, probably. I'll try and push forward one of my arms. Yeah, hopefully we can. Uh... I'd like to get Sparta back in, in the war, but they're they're making peace with everyone. They're they're becoming a peaceful they're nation. They're sitting tight, aren't they? Yeah. Sparta, a peaceful nation. I don't think those two words go well together, or two phrases. It's very These do look pretty battered, the Macedonian army though. Yeah, it's looking battered but And they lost their archers. Ah, at least they lost them. They can just rehire them. <laughs> <laughs> So really, all I've done, I I think Macedon now Macedon has a land border with you, which is interesting. They do, yeah. They're now a threat. Yeah. Well. So I need to uh, play my cards right, I suppose. I am not spending a single penny <laughs> on the I... Olympics. That's just not going to happen. 
Right, let's get up to speed. I am going to upgrade nothing because nothing is upgrading. Calcus is getting happier by the day. So let's see if I can leave my settlements. Okay. Probably not. <laughs> uh, let's have a look. Minus 17. I might be able to. Um, the only thing that changed is that... How can I, how can I see this? I don't know. Maybe because my turn's not ended. But Macedon has brought up another army, but it's only a seven stack. And they got force marched to Farsalus. Yeah, I saw that. Oh, There's right. a tw no, a 20 stack. No, no, no. The 20 stack's the army I've just fought. There's a seven stack. Why? Yeah. Um, not sure if I'm ready to hit that on myself. It's quite a bit going on. Let's see if I can take out this Faray settlement. Maybe. I don't even know if I'm going to try and defend Mende, to be honest. How much money is it bringing? 400, though. Oh, you know what? I can just reduce my taxes and the settlement's going to be happy anyway. Yep, right, let's uh, push forward. Cautiously. Not but I will be taking over far right now. And I don't think their armies can... One army can reach me. But um, I have got superior, superior units here, so good. I should be fine. Um... Good. Orios, what are you saying? Orios's garrison is not the best. That's what I'm concerned about. I'd say I think it should be okay. They wouldn't go. I don't think they go that way to come and get you. Also, if you need to, you can always pull back. Just make a fortress and just like defend, yeah, I can defend do. the crossing. I mean, what else I can do as well? I'm going to start building up my next army. So I will not be building some more goat herding pens. I'm going to be building up some more units. Excellent. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Uh, I'll build another one of the U's. Okay, my army is starting to be built. So is my beautiful navy, which is being overwhelmingly surrounded by other units, but fine. <laughs> Uh, Andros is fine, so I'm going to push you into my new army. In you go. Now be military training sword out. I wonder if you have any uh, bonuses towards... What have you got? Ah, oh, there it is. Um... Hmm, okay. Sorry, I'm just messing around now. It's alright. No yep, worries. so do that. That and that and that. Lovely. Right. I think I'm good to go. Excellent. Still can do a diplomacy front. Byzantium, can we make friends? Or oh, no, okay. Probably because you're allied with me. Yeah, it's just... Oh, well, not just... Even, you're not allied, but associated. <laughs> you, know this per you know this person. I don't <laughs> like you. Yeah, I just realised I'm at war with pretty much everyone at this point, apart from Persia and Sparta. Join the club. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, okay. Let's right. see if my army gets attacked, because um, that's going to be I'm one hell of a battle. I'm doing nothing for the old... Oh yeah, he was just like a random leader. I now have 6,000 income. Sweet. I'm going to do my first thing that I realised I was going to do last game. So we're going to auto-resolve. I found a rogue Ionian League um, navy. Well, not navy, but uh, army, which I've just killed with my navy. Oh, fantastic. So we've damaged it and brought it down to three very depleted units. And what have we got here? Not much. I could go and finish it then. If you could if you could help in uh, cast us, that would be grand, because uh, that's that's not looking too good. Um, I'll see what I can do. I mean, even just putting your navy just there as a deterrent. Um, yeah, I'm just clearing up the Ionian League right now. But yes, I it's could. Not bad, I yeah, I might be able to. Persia's also bringing fleets out. They into, are. Into, They're not. Into places I'm not liking. Really. The um, Golden Voyages, they're called. Yeah, can't see anything, but hey. My navy is probably actually my most upgraded, like, um, like, army. Well. You know, force, <laughs> you know. It's more upgraded my, than my armies, definitely. I've got, like, some silver chevrons in this army compared to, like, my main so army. I say, if you see my navy, charge straight into the uh, into the army up of that mountain up there. Yeah. <laughs> Lots of casualties. Yes, yeah, that was not 
that was not the best wording, but oh well. I was going to say. Um, <laughs> Lorien. We just, we just wrote them down like slaves. <laughs> um, I think... What's you? You're a fleet. Oh, 15, though. I'm not liking the look of that. I'll bring you into Naxos for now. If you put an army on a navy, does it then move the same speed as the navy? Uh, no, I don't think it does. I wish it did, because then I could get quickly over to some of these Ionian League settlements. Yeah, no, it doesn't, because I was trying to get into Andros, and it was a mess around, so I don't oh, think it does. Brilliant. Might be wrong, but it'll be very well defended, because transport ships are made of literally plywood. They just snap. Oh, okay. Um, right, do the disciples of Zeus like me? No, not at all. I have actually a huge risk for um, civil war, so I'm going to spend some money on a loyalty. Oh, I should probably check that myself. 18% um, for me. Uh, that's not bad. Can I actually adopt anyone? I'd like to adopt people. <laughs> Spread rumours. Come adopt. join my family. Yes, please come join my family. Um, yeah, Gillis, I'll adopt you. Can I marry you off now? Secure promotion, send emissary. Organise games, send diplomat. Seek a spouse. Right, and then... He ah! This is how we get more people that um, to uh, like be of your faction and have armies. I think. How have you managed that? Because I married, I married, married <laughs> I, mar I, I adopted a woman who then married someone. So I now have <laughs> another army that's loyal to me and only me, the son of Ares. Oh, I haven't even, I haven't even got any daughters. Yeah. So I'm gonna do that. So I'm gonna then buy a lot of hoplites to replace all the ones I just lost. <laughs> and then uh, I would like to make peace with the Thessalian League, if that's possible. Oh my god, if, if you get one of your family members to commit suicide, you get two loyalty from all other parties for doing so. That's pretty good. It's pretty brutal. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty. if you've got a lot of family members to get rid of them, yeah, do it. But yeah, I, I've got I, everyone apart from my uh, three-year-old son. <laughs> I only have... Um, Even my wife can do it. Yeah, I only have two two uh, generals that are actually part of my army. After that, everyone else is... Um, the only other ones actually are... Actually, yeah, both of the Disciples of Zeus that are like part of it only are um, politicians. They don't have any roles in my government, like Navy or... Anything else? Um, so yeah, that's okay. I can live with that. Uh, I'm trying to see whether I can do anything, but I really shouldn't even bother because everyone hates me. <laughs> yeah, would, I'm not would, bothering would, either. Would Athens actually dare? Greetings in the name of Hermes. Probably not. I wanted to make peace with Athens for now, but that was never going to happen. Oh, who's that? Whose sigil is one of a turtle? Um. Huh. Oh yeah. Kaidonia, yeah, they bring Bites in of the army. Basilisk. Yeah, Are you bring... war with them? No. <laughs> I know, they're getting very near. I don't like it. I might... Uh... Could be nothing. It could be nothing. How far are they away? Uh, <laughs> still a near little enough. way. There's still a little way, but they can't actually reach any settlement. I'll see how... If they get any nearer, I might recruit a quick army or navy. But hey, we'll oh, see. Sparta's damn near cleared out the uh, house on the south, though. Yeah, I know. If they decide to uh, do anything else, then that could be a problem. Let's see what happens. Yeah, anyway. I will end the turn, and we will see what happens. I think I'm going to get attacked by Maston. I am more than sure of it. I wouldn't be surprised if my last summon in the, in the north, in like the colonies, finally is lost. Um, after all oh, this. Yeah, you've got all that as well, figure. I mean, I'm not really figuring with it now, Scream. It's just being left to do its own thing. <laughs> Like, yeah, if, if you're still here when we get here, fantastic. If not, you're free to just do your own thing. Yeah, very much so. Um, oh, they didn't oh, attack. No, me. they didn't attack. I may raise Probably very wise. My army is pretty buff. Yeah. Oh, oh there we I'm go. I'm in league, though. Um, I'm going to win this battle. The only problem is... Oh, Grasslands. Yeah, it says I'm going to win this battle. So do I want... don't know... Yeah, do you want to just auto-resolve? Well, no, it's not a massive win, though. It's very much three quarters of the way, so... Do you want to I fight feel this one be... in the uh, next episode? Because we are coming up to the uh, the mark. 
Shall we, or should we, should, do you think we fit one more in? I think it'll be quite a short one, because there's not a lot going on here. Yeah, we can do it in this episode then, yeah, sure. Go on then. Oh, yeah, I am not looking like I'm going to win this. It, this looks very bizarre, though, because it's not massive. I don't know. I had one like this in the last episode, um, in a few episodes ago, when Mastodon just attacked me, and they had no chance of winning, but the AI just thought, let's give it a go and see what happens. So... Yeah, it's it's, one oh, of those. it's definitely an invasion. Huh. No, it just feels very strange because it seems very balanced, but it doesn't seem very balanced at the same time. I don't know what to make of it. Yeah, I need to see what after this what Kaidonia are doing and if they're coming anywhere nearer to Athens. Aye, indeed. But hey, we'll see. They may just. So be... I worry they would do this. If I win this battle, I clear them out. If I clear them out. We're looking pretty good in the south. Yeah, and then I can finally start sending some more um, ships and armies to islands and stuff. Well, I'm hoping to do the same once once that little uh, little stretch of land decides to stop rebelling against me. I'm planning to do the same. Oh, good. <laughs> oh, it's a good. nightmare. Yes. I've got to a stage where if I reduce taxes to nothing, I can get them on my side. But if I build a more happiness buildings, yeah. it is very foggy here. I just realized. I'm I thought near... it was a loading screen. It's not. It's just fog. <laughs> I'm nearly in. This army, this navy I've got is just, I've just realised, is uh, all marines. <laughs> oh, yeah. Send in the marines. Yeah, this is... I'm going to just aim for that lighthouse. Oh, my God. Right. I just... I don't know what to do here, because yeah. what have you... Have you got transport ships? No, these are proper naval ships. These are proper naval ships, yeah. Right, boys. We can see... Fuck all. <laughs> aim, <laughs> aim for that. Aim for that lighthouse over there. That's, that's not a lighthouse. That's the captain trying to trying to send you a signal, sir. Oh <laughs> fuck, we've shot it. Oh. Is it on fire? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm just gonna go straight. I don't know what I don't know what the best thing to do is here. I'm gonna rush you. <laughs> you can rush me all you want. I don't know. Oh Christ, you are rushing me. Yeah, uh, I'm not set up yet. Well, I need every advantage because this is a really like. If you put everything on the beaches, you probably actually just destroy me because I can't get everything off at once. Actually, yeah, but you've got reinforcements coming in as well. Do I? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I do. You've got, you've got a second army coming in. So have I. Excellent. Bizarrely, I've got a second army coming in. I don't know why they're not already here, but there we I, go. I thought this was it for my army. Well, this this could be uh, more interesting then. <laughs> I just don't know what to make of it. I'm just putting things down. Yeah, that'll do. <laughs> I, I, there's no tactical planning going on. I have on, really. two more armies coming in. You shouldn't have two more. I yeah, I've got one. a fleet and um, some troops. It's, probably, it's uh, cavalry, that's why. It's just some cavalry I have. <laughs> Do you know what my reinforcements is? What? It's my general from my other army. Just uh, him. Just him. Oh, Alright, guys, I thought I'd come join you. This How makes it doing? interesting then, because, yeah, I now have, like, proper units. You can see why I was skeptical. Yeah, but then you've got a proper navy, and so I don't know why you didn't lovely... fight me. You you probably were. Uh, hmm. I don't know. I say you were probably outnumbered me. I I felt evil. there would be no justice if I just auto resolved. It's all right. Yeah, we can fight this. This will be a close one. If I win though, which I kind of want to, because obviously winning a battle is great, but um. See You'll you, set me back. Yeah, setbacks. I don't really want it. <laughs> so, if people accuse me of losing this um, on purpose, that they would be false because I will try and win this. <laughs> it 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 will just be annoying. Right. Um, let's send you in. And then, then let's bring. Oh no, you also can go in. It's really annoying me that you can't like make the ships go faster you need to go faster stripes yeah but they don't have them <laughs> <laughs> uh still not sure what my battle plan is here currently i'm just kind of fortifying but there's literally no difference to what i would do usually in the settlement mm -hmm. well i think i've found a good landing spot which is far enough away <laughs> So we'll go in there, and then I'll bring these guys into support. And jobs are good and I mean, you're a general. Ships ready. To the oars. Move out. 
Ah, I found your general. <laughs> yeah, one of several generals. Could I ride him down? <laughs> you can try, but it's spearmen versus horses. They never go well together. Yeah, no, I might as well just wait. Just loving how useless my archers are being. Yeah. As per the norm. Yeah, I definitely did the wrong decision on trying to um, just sit there and shoot you. In one of my campaigns, I managed to do that. Oh god, we might as well land. Oh hmm. land, boys, land quickly. Oh, I made a mistake not landing quicker. <laughs> <laughs> There's boats on fire! That's the plan! Yeah, one of them's doing okay, but one of them's not doing so okay. One of them is doing very no not okay. Very not okay. Yes, this is the English I'm using. The Queen's English. Some, the Queen. some would say. Right, can we just land there? No, you're going to insist on crashing into that one. Oh, just get off. I like how your whole, like, defense on the shores has got scared off by one small javelin unit. <laughs> it's more, funny. it's just trying to avoid your melee infantry now. That's yeah. kind of where I'm at. Yeah, I finally decided to bring them in instead of just having a good old shoot off. <laughs> I just wish some of my guys learned how to land. <laughs> Alright, remember all your hardcore training? Yeah. Just remember it. Nothing else. <laughs> yeah, please. And everything we've taught you and you're designed to do, please just do it now. Where are you landing? Can you land here, please? What are you doing over there? Uh, what am I doing? Yeah. I'm making a nice little uh, pocket to defend. <laughs> pocket? It seems like it, yeah. You've come out and... Uh, Certainly unusual compared to what I usually do, so there's Yeah, that. but at the same time, I didn't want to land right by your troops, and I didn't know if these guys were going to be able to just land straight off the bat, but they, they managed it. Oh, yeah, and also, I have no idea what this landing... Like, these guys... Idiots. It's just it's just idiots, Scrim. Don't worry about <laughs> that. So, uh, yeah, I'm just going to wait. Nicely. 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 Where are all my javelins and archers and stuff? Yeah, I'm definitely not going to win this. I have a feeling. Uh, is this a proper army that you have garrisoned here, or is this just a garrison? No, 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 this is just a garrison. It just so happens that, um... There's a lot of good units in it. Oh yeah. my gosh, can these transports just frickin' land? Boys, just land already. I might win, like, the normal fight, but I doubt it. I'm aware of your cavalry, don't worry about that. Oh, actually, keep going in, boys. Keep going in. These are only arch marines. <laughs> well, I have mercenaries that are very, very good. They are, yeah. Annoyingly so. What are... These guys... Hmm... There we go, right, get out of there. Broken enough, guys. Um, now land. Actually, no, land here. God damn it. Fucking transport ships. <laughs> Now these are only... Hmm. Wish I could land in the actual dock. That would be quite cool. Yeah, that would be actually. Don't know why. Oh, I just realised... I just realised that the um, boats when they land just like rise up a little bit. Oh, it looks beautiful. 
Beautiful. Love it, CA. <laughs> okay, can you turn around ready? Just ready to land. Oh, this is your general now. Finally landing. I mean, one of the generals, but he's not actually the general. That's still the admiral. Oh, God! It's going sideways. It was going sideways. Brilliant. Right. I love how absolutely useless my javelin men are. Well, you, they are kind of like fighting against proper actual javelin units compared to... Um, okay, what are you doing over here? You're just sending up your guys and scaring. <laughs> Excellent. Let's finish them. I think I made a mistake here. What, by coming to this island? Yes. Uh, sallying forth. Yeah, you should have left me just, like, if you carried on where you were, then you would have, um, certainly just have not had the problem of, that you are currently having of, uh, like, one of my units is surrounding you. Is it? Oh, no, it was surrounding you. F forget what I'm saying. Not quite, though. Not quite anymore. Oh, this is such an irritating circumstances to be under. I'm sure. <sighs> oh. Yeah, you've got me over there. Yep. Yeah. Knew you'd do that. This is going to be a close battle. Like you said. It is going to be a close battle, but I'm getting a slightly anxious. I shouldn't have sallied forth. Hurry up. I know you're heavy infantry. Just hurry up. Anything you can do. Okay, brilliant. Not what I wanted, I will admit. <laughs> I saw what I was doing there. Yeah. <sighs> Still getting stupidly nervous. It's now the power balance of power is now very even. It is very annoyingly even. I and mean, then you can see my voice is getting more dense as this happens. Oh, but more of my units are just about to break. Oh wow, yeah, that's a bit of a major break you're having as well. Yeah. Oh, you you. Mm. What? <laughs> Just saw you smash your cavalry through. Yeah. Hope. Come on. Your units are definitely winning in that whole theatre there. This is a shameful display. <sighs> Ready quickly now. Yeah, they're pretty weak. These cavalry already now. Yeah. Not great. Oh, javelins, what are you doing? Your marines are holding steady in a very annoying fashion. I say, you say that, but some of them are now breaking. <laughs> Why do you have to speak, Scrim? They... Oh, your general's now to go into the main line. Interesting. Yeah, your marines compared to mine are very much... Oh, these are armoured. That's why mine are just marines. Ah, that would make sense. Uh, this is just... An oh, I might just finally win in this peninsula, that small peninsula down there. Because of the cavalry. Uh, yeah, actually, can you just can you just throw stuff at them? I don't really want you to. Uh... Swift melee cavalry. Oh yeah, you're gonna win in one area, but you're gonna lose in the other. I think. It's just an irritation at this point. Come on. I 
an entire unit of paper, but you are surrounded by general now. So I wonder hey. if that will actually inflict morale on the main army, though. That's what I'm worried I'm about. not sure, because you've got picked up lights over there, and that's your other general. Yeah, which will be interesting. I think you still got it. You still got picked up lights as another general, and then. Oh, oh they're armoured marines. Okay. Mm. Oh, it will be close. Come there. on, just get into formation and hold. I only have two solid units of infantry. And even then, they're not solid units. So it'll be close. Ah, oh, general's fallen. Okay. Actually, no. I hold. can't relieve those units either. I want to relieve those units, but the, uh, my others are too tired. I'm going to have to leave them to die. <laughs> That's unfortunate as well. It's my general a... as well. A general. Is it? This? Oh, yeah. yeah. It's one of. Yeah. He's not killed him yet, but he is one of them. Phew. Okay. An entire unit has perished. Never. Oh no. Well, my not... infantry line is not as long as yours, and it's not a great infantry line either. It's a bloody cavalry unit again. Yeah, they're very useful, this cavalry. Yeah, just a bit. I kind of actually want to look at the uh, Ionian forces. I've not actually seen them in action yet. Uh, I like the lime green. Lime green works. Have a look, boys. See what's about to charge. Actually, yes. Get out of this. F look. Um, right, okay. You charge in there. You charge in there. You charge in there. You charge in there. Yeah, what is it? Not surprised that you left the cavalry behind. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. With the uh, archers having to be supporting my infantry is never a good sign. It's not gonna happen. I didn't realize you ran out of ammunition as well. Yeah, just just then. Yeah, that that'll be GG to be honest. So looking at. Yeah, of course I can't cap with them on horseback. I might as well just try and win the day over here. Good charge coming in here. Oh, they're so yeah, bloody. I'm watching it happen. So bloody are these cavalry right now. Oh. Unfortunately, I've got them caught as well between two units. Yeah. All my units <sighs> break it. Even oh no, close. only the. Right. Yep, here we go. It's only the pick top lights left. I just realised you didn't actually get my general. My general's here. Oh yeah, yeah. I know I didn't get your general. Your general's marines. It's got a different general, which is just the general of the uh, garrison. <laughs> oh, this is going to be. <laughs> and you said, oh, this will take no time. This is a. Uh, I didn't realise what was that. St I didn't realise I would make that error of sallying forth. Sallied forth to think I took you by surprise. It didn't quite work no, the way I was hoping. No, it was... Uh, but uh, that, that was one hell of a battle. It was. I have two cavalry left. <laughs> two units of cavalry just running. Will they break before they charge into the back lines? Yeah, they're going to break. They no. can't. Oh, watch. there we go. Just no. killed your general. Yeah, but watch them charge in. Boosh. <laughs> and they're now in the middle of the battle line. But they're in like, the but worst not, place. Yeah, but they're not breaking anymore. So, ah, uh, now they are. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, they're breaking. Now they are, yes. But the middle, the one in the middle, is right in the middle. He's surrounded. He's my new general. I promoted him. <laughs> oh, he that broke. One, you mean the one guy trying to break through the back lines? Yeah, he, he broke. <laughs> oh, he's he is broken, and he's is he dead? No, is no, he gonna he's, live? He's, he, oh, the other one's still alive as well. We I'm have, watching him. We have two. The one on the brown horse is my general. But oh, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Did, that was. That, even on deployed, you only have 50 units more as well. Yeah. Wow. I, I've i lost all the battles today. Not looking good. <laughs> we'll go the to this here. Yeah. The good news is, if we can hold down the south, though, because my armies are only growing in the south. Yeah. Which means pushing north is now... 
order of the day. So in a good way, it's good that I, I won. Because I'm not going to have to fall back again. Yeah, it's just that, obviously, it's a, I don't know. This is that's a, that's that settlement's very near on revolting again, though. That's the problem. It won't. It won't do soon because I'm going to reduce my taxes, which will take a hit on my economy. But for a few turns, it's worth it. Excellent. And because I won, there's going to be no public disorder because I won. So that's very good. Let's see how badly my navy took a hit, though. Oh. It's so uh, garrison army's done in. The fleet's done in. I've only lost three units in the garrison army. Everything else is alive and well. Excellent. <sighs> right, I'm going to enslave people, I think. <laughs> Slaves! Oh, that contributes to public disorder. I just realised. Yeah. Probably Never wants mind. to do release them. Maybe get the money. They were sinking. Yeah. Oh, uh, well. Anyway, we'll just get to my turn and then we'll uh, End the call episode. it a save. Yeah. Hi. The only in League of Obstinia have just deployed the agents like we Oh, must and Kydonia is coming very close to Athens. They are, yeah. Um, I'm not quite sure what to do. Whether the thing is, they've sat, they've done, sat there for the best part of 50 turns doing nothing. And now they've decided to... Yeah. I guess we'll find out... Oh, Rebellion in a minute. Um, okay. We'll, we'll find out in the next episode, I guess. Absolutely. So, guys, if you've enjoyed this episode, please remember to like and subscribe. Sorry for how long it was. We've had a lot of battles in this episode. But if you've enjoyed, please like and subscribe to my channel and check out Scrims for his perspective of the uh, of the battles. Yeah, absolutely. It's and, getting uh, quite intense here. Yeah, it is. It really is. And until next time, guys, bye for now.